So this is our topic, power of a power. For any real number, A, and any positive integers, M and N, so the quantity of A raised to the power of M, the quantity raised to the power of N, so that is equal to A raised to the power of M times N. Okay? Ibig sabihin, multiply natin yan si M at saka si N. So that's why nagiging M, N or M times N So let's have example number 1 The quantity of X squared The quantity raised to the power of 3 So ang gagawin natin dito Si X squared Okay I-multiply natin kay 3 Ayan, di ba? I-multiply natin yan So the result is Okay X Kapiyan natin yung base nya at saka i-multiply natin si 2 at saka si 3. So, the result is 6 or x to the 6 power. Okay, this is your final answer sa ating example number 1. Okay, let's proceed to number 2. The quantity of a cube, the quantity raised to the power of 5. So, ang gagawin natin, una, kopyahin natin yung base at saka yung uh, exponent na 3. I-multiply natin kay 5. Okay? Okay, hindi mo na lagyan ng uh, quantity. Okay na yan, ha? So, equals. Kupiyan natin si base na A. At i-multiply natin si 3 at saka si 5. Therefore, the result is 15. Or, A raised to the power of 15. Or, A to the 15th power. Okay? So, last example, number 3. Y, or the quantity of Y to the 4th power, the quantity raised to the power of 2. So, kaya natin yung base na A, ano uh, Y, and then yung 4, tapos i-multiply natin yan kay 2. Okay? So, equals, kaya natin yung base na Y, and i-multiply natin si 4 at saka si 2. So, therefore, yung exponent niya is 8. 4 times 2 is 8. So, Y to the 8 power. This is your final answer.